So, um, yesterday, uh, last night in Canada, Pokemon Go finally arrived. Tyler still hasn't downloaded it. Because he, he can't. And uh, so, we're going to go and get a, uh, a SIM card so we can actually play it here in Portugal. Sorry, he's, he's going to get a SIM card so that he can play it in Portugal. It's for content. Dude, this food cart is full of hot Where should we go? Oh, oh, Jesus, okay. Oddish. Oh, don't fuck oh, around, it's pincer. Second try. Second try with the pincer. Look at him, look at him. It's gonna give you a little nibble. Forget about wanting to be the very best. I am the very best, like no one ever was. Let's go to the sea, maybe we can get magic air for the Got a do duo. What is it now? It's a Zubat. Yeah. Got Growlithe now. That'll be my new dog dad. What is it? It's a Pidgey. And it's on your junk. Oh shit. Move. Congratulations, you earned a medal. Got oh. 10 flying type Pokemon. 10 Zubat. First go, caught an Ekans, big dumb snake. Dumb old snake thought it could get away from me. No. Did you know Ekans is just snake backwards? And Arbok is just Cobra backwards, just with a, with a K. So our children can't spell. I earned a medal. Hey, this is officially the end of our YouTube channel now. Um, I leveled up. Oh, did you yeah. level up? What did you do today? No? My dignity, that's what I did. I guess one of the good things about it though is that it gets people outside, it gets people moving, and it We're gets exploring Porto. Yeah, it gets people to explore, see places that they normally wouldn't see looking for these focus stops. Exactly. So that up there is the Miro uh, Cache de Pedra Pedras from 1394. Can't see it, but maybe you can. But we wouldn't have come here without Pokemon Go. Take that, TripAdvisor. And so this is the uh, Esculturas de Monumento. And across the street is the Palacio de da Bolsa. It's a palace. It's a game. I mean, like, inherently people think, ah, it's a game, it's a waste of time, but we're out here, there's tons of people out here. People are meeting because of this game. It's fantastic. It'll be it'll be awesome for backpackers as well. You know, gives like a whole new like objective almost to travel. Yeah, you walk around, you see everything that you want to see, and you catch Pokemon along the way. Yeah, dude, I just got four Pokeballs. Wow. Yeah. Funny thing is, is that it was originally a children's game, and now we're seeing people walking around with average age, like early to mid twenties, males. Grow up, and they like the things. Skag. Haters gonna hate. He said it. Yeah. Johto, Kanto, Porto. So we hope you guys enjoyed the uh, Pokemon tour of the Porto region. Uh, now we're just back here at the hostel, uh, hanging out and uh, recovering from the long day of catching them all. So, have a 
Have a good one, Jason. Cheers. Wild Pidgey appeared. It got away.